Is it time to buy or sell Microsoft stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Microsoft. Our initial report was published on our website on Thursday, the 6th of June, 2024. And now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since May 14, 2024, our system has ranked Microsoft as a buy candidate, giving it a score of 1.81. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock has seen a gain of 1.91%, this translates to an average return of 0.11% per day since it was listed as buy candidate. The stock is at the upper part of a wide and horizontal trend, and normally this may pose a good selling opportunity, but a breakup through the top trend line at $430.72 will give a strong buy signal and a trend shift could be expected. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 0.289% change over the next three months, with a possible return between negative 7.90% and 1.75%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a 37.48% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between 27.52% and 40.95%. This translates to a price range of $541.33 to $598.37 after a year. Our latest daily update for Microsoft includes the headline, Microsoft stock price up 0.120% on Thursday. The Microsoft stock price gained 0.120% on the last trading day, Thursday, 6th of June, 2024, rising from $424.01 to $424.52. It has now gained three days in a row. It will be exciting to see whether it manages to continue gaining or take a minor break for the next few days. During the last trading day, the stock fluctuated 1.12% from a day low at $420.58 to a day high of $425.31. The price has risen in six of the last 10 days, but is still down by negative 1.39% for this period. Volume fell on the last day by negative 1 million shares, and in total, 15 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $6,280,000,000. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $433.60 and the lowest price was $309.45. Currently, the price is 2.09% or $9.08 below the 52-week high of $433.60 which is also the all-time high for stock. Analyst ratings. On Tuesday, June 4, 2024, it was reported that Barclays gave Microsoft an overweight grade with a hold action. On Tuesday, May 28, 2024, it was reported that Citigroup gave Microsoft a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, May 22, 2024, it was reported that Mizuho Securities gave Microsoft a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, May 22, 2024, it was reported that Bank of America Securities gave Microsoft a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, May 22, 2024, it was reported that Goldman Sachs gave Microsoft a buy grade with a hold action. Analysts have given Microsoft stock a general strong buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. 
For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong buy rating. The following signals have been identified for Microsoft. The Microsoft stock holds buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $419.58 and $413.77. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Monday, June 3, 2024, and so far it has risen 2.66%, Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Volume fell during the last trading day, despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price, and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MATD. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, sell signal, pivots, buy signal four days ago, Bollinger, buy signal 12 days ago, short-term moving average, buy signal three days ago, long-term moving average, buy signal 20 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 18 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, buy signal three days ago, the long-term moving average, buy signal 25 days ago, the relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 150 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, risk, and stop loss for Microsoft. Microsoft finds support from accumulated volume at $416.42, and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. In general, the stock tends to have very controlled movements, and with good liquidity, the risk is considered very low in this stock. During the last day, the stock moved $4.73 between high and low, or 1.12%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 1.90%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Microsoft, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earnings. This is a relatively normal PE ratio, often seen in businesses with long track records or predictable revenues. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2024 is expected on July 23, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $2.90. Keep an eye on these numbers as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Microsoft. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Microsoft is at $425.22. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Microsoft encounters its first support level at $416.42. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Microsoft from multiple analyst sources is strong buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On 2024 May 31st, Numoto Teishi conducted an insider sell of 322 shares of common stock. On 2024 June 3rd, Numoto Teishi conducted an insider sell of 244 shares of common stock. On 2024 May 30th, Numoto Takeshi conducted an insider sell of 209,529 shares of common stock. 
On 2024, May 31st, Numoto Takeshi conducted an insider sell of 158,762 shares of common stock. On 2024, May 30th, Jala Alice L conducted an insider sell of 6,031 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of negative 39,298. Overall, insiders purchased 103,745 shares and sold 187,355 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $403.77, minus 4.89%. This stock has low daily movements, which translates to low risk. A buy signal was detected from a pivot bottom identified 10 days ago. Is Microsoft stock a good buy? Several short-term signals are positive, and we conclude that the current level may hold a buying opportunity, as there is a fair chance for Microsoft stock to perform well in the short-term period. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Friday, June 7th, we expect Microsoft to open down negative $1.05 and start trading at $423.47. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.